Hey there guys, so today we have another review and this is a beer from Other Half. I have to thank Will for this one, so thank you so much. This is Double Mosaic Dream, double IPA, just reviewed it. But this is the double dry hop version that they just released. Really excited to dig into this one. And the interesting thing about this beer is that it's double dry hop, but they use lupulin powder. So you can have wet hops pulled from the vine. You can turn those into fresh hops, which is uh, something like uh, Sierra Nevada uses. You can turn those into pellets is what most uh, places use, is hop, hop pellets. And then you could also turn it into hop oil. And then now we have lupulin powder. So hop powder. Uh, apparently it just is a powder of uh, uh, made from the hops without all that green matter that you get from the um, hops. So uh, really interesting. Definitely the first beer I've had with um, hop powder. So the beer comes in a medium gold color, medium plus haze on that. Let's get the wrong one, this one. Mm, bright kind of citrus notes, uh, but leaning mostly towards tropical, passion fruit, uh, mango notes, papaya. Almost a little bit of like cotton candy sweetness. Oh yeah, for sure. Um, yeah, like candied tropical fruits. And then a little bit of biscuity malt. Some like underlying huge dank qualities. Yeah, it has that kind of like vegetal, bitter vegetable kind of thing. Uh, really interesting. Cheers. Oh, oh, yeah. There's the mosaic. Whoa, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. So it falls on the palate, very much like the aroma. It has that big kind of tropical quality up front. Mm, very nice. It's a really nice kind of soft kind of um, uh, candy kind of tropical uh, action. Mango, passion fruit, papaya, a little bit of stone fruit leading towards like an apricot kind of flavor throughout, uh, a little bit of biscuity malt, but then you get this kind of like ripping green quality. Again, it's uh, if you're mosaic head, you're going to be okay with it. I surely know that there are people that don't like mosaic and you're definitely not going to like this one. But yeah, it's that like sharp, kind of green and earthy quality that hits the palate. Um, reminds me of the Hill Farm said in Trillium beers that have mosaic on it. It's just straight mosaic bomb. It's very earthy, has these green kind of bitter vegetables digging on the palate. This one even has a little bit of bitterness to it, like a medium um, bitterness to it. Dries out quite nicely. 8.5%, very well executed. Um, I'd argue it's just as good as the uh, double mosaic dream. Um, I've had a, I would have a hard time really, you know, a week ago only having one can and then now sitting with this can for first impressions to really like completely tell you that it's a completely different beer. There probably are nu nuanced differences. Um, I'm just not familiar with them, but I would say it's just as good as for a rating. One of the better uh, other half beers. Let's go with something like a 97 minus. 97 minus. Uh, nine, yeah, 97, 97 minus. Until next time, guys, cheers. Let me know what you think about this beer. Later.